today we start Sonny Webster's weightlifting program, but this morning we're going to do our conditioning. We've been joined by Lee, who did not turn up yesterday. This is my punishment. Unbelievable. How's it feel being the garage gym box dog? Alright, you just do your thing. You've got to like pet him in. You ever see, you ever see it up? More of the dogs? No. It reminds me of like all them like chasing around and that. You are my master! <laughs> oh boy! Oh boy! Go boy! Today's workout is meant to be pretty fast, so it's like a you go, I go workout. 10 calories on the bike, 10 deadlifts at 80 kg. Sixteen minutes and fifty seconds. I challenge anyone out there to give that a go. It's remarkable how two simple moves, two simple things, hurt so much. Nice start to the day. Short, sharp, fast, and sweet. Feel good, Lee? Yeah. And it comes down to like one point, two points. Doing some myofascial release as well as some mobility at the same time, whilst watching the fittest on Earth for probably the eleventh time. <laughs> oh, it hurts so bad, but it feels so good. It's written in like it's written in like code. Apparently, it's how weightlifting programs are supposed to be written. There are <laughs> there are some moves on here that I've never even heard of. What's a Chinese jerk? Da, 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 da. We're going to be needing these today. Yep. Yep. Click. We're also going to be needing this today. Do you want to click again? Yep. Jazz, we're not going to get to the box in that. Click again. Well, Jump out of the world! <laughs> Sorry. It's so weird sometimes. <laughs> what are you even doing? Click again. Nailed it. Ever since Jasmine watched Moana, she's mentioned 14 holidays, 15 scuba diving trips. One of my main goals with this YouTube channel is to get Jasmine to CrossFit Wonderlust in Bali. That's like... That would be so much fun. Ever since day one, Hey bro, did he do any tricks? Uh, have you got any food? No. no Grace, food. sit down. <laughs> sit down. She's like, no. She does, she does. Grace, <laughs> it's, it's the camera's on her. Sit down. Wait, what's this? Sit down. You're <laughs> sh <laughs> Get in the car, get in. <laughs> That's unheard of. Yeah. We've not had that long away from here since we're on holiday in yeah. Cyprus last week. <laughs> in total we've had nine days away from here. In a row. I don't know how I survived to be honest. Hey bro. You right? Did you miss us? I have noticed you haven't been around for a while. Ears in, ears out, ears in, ears out. Is in? Is out. Well, if you've got collie ears, they don't go in. So, uh, <laughs> it's only out. On a scale of 1 to 10, Kieran, how much have you missed us at the box over the last nine days? Not much room for improvement. Probably 10. It was... Was it a hard week? It was tough. It was tough. <laughs> Look at you had your few days out, so I was like, what's he gonna vlog about? I was like, this is really weird. Are you excited to get strong? <laughs> Always excited to get strong. From this angle, it looks so weird. <laughs> Jazz is going down. What are you doing? Da -da -da. Duck walks, good for the knees, ankles, warming up the hips. Hey, Ed. you good? Yeah, yeah. You doing abs? Ab class done. Yeah. Wait. Three days to go until the holidays. Back squats, snatch, snatch pulls. It's good to be back. It's good to be back. Sometimes you need a little bit of time away to appreciate what you have. And that nine days away when you come back in and like you see everyone again and you're just like, yes, the family's here. Um, yeah, it's just... Makes it not so much of a trip. Yeah. Exactly. This, it's just cool. Lift. 
Hi John. How are you doing? Is this where the weightlifters hang out? It is where the weightlifters hang out. Mate. Oh, nice. How's it going? All right. Our best get comfy over the next six weeks. How long do you usually sit here for? Uh, as long as possible. Okay. And two people start looking at me. <laughs> yeah. And you just load the bar just so it looks good. Yeah. And every now and again I'll like adjust it. <laughs> yeah. So you don't actually lift it. No, no, no. I'm just just all sit shape. by it. And all yeah, shape. I got yeah. it. No, that's it. Okay. <laughs> How to be a weightlifter. <laughs> What is going on team? Craig G back with another commentary over this video. So week one of Sonny Webster's weightlifting program underway and started off with a bang. Five by five back squats at 80% of our 1RM. So my 1RM at the moment is 180 kg. So we did this at around 145. Felt really, really good apart from the last set where the last rep moved slower than the Titanic and you'll see that in a minute. But I just wanted to use this commentary to give out one super simple tip to up your back squat. So on the screen right now are two of my back squat sets. You're seeing set two and set four. Kind of playing a game of spot the difference here, but if you look at my hand placement, both sets are completely different. When it comes to squatting, you need a strong, stable core and upper back. It doesn't matter how strong your legs are, if you don't have a strong, stable core and kind of upper thoracic area, you're gonna cave, you're gonna drop the bar, especially when it gets heavy. Now I'm guilty of this. Usually I'll just walk up to the bar, I'll put my hands on the bar, I'll get under it and I'll start squatting. But I know that when I go for my maxes, my upper body, kind of my, my kind of my mid thoracic will give out first. And it's because I forget to do what you're seeing on the right hand side, which is keep my hands narrow and kind of lock myself under the bar. What this is going to do is it's going to engage my lats, my traps, my rhomboids, my rear doubts, my kind of upper back muscles when doing squats, as these do play a vital role in power transference through the legs to stand you up. Basically, the narrow hand position creates more tension because then you can pull your elbows in towards your hips and you can push them further forward, which then drives your chest upwards, but also maintains your good form. So if you're one of those people that do squats and end up doing kind of good mornings, just try bringing in your hands a little bit more. But ultimately, this position will help allow your hips to come through at the right time, help you drive your hips back upwards and allow the bar to sit over the center of mass and make the weight feel a lot lighter. But anyway, exercise two and exercise three of Sonny's weightlifting program was some snatching and then into some heavy snatch pulls at 100 to 110% of our 1RM. And I enjoyed it. But anyway, if you did enjoy this commentary and you are enjoying the video, please smash that like button. It really, really does help the channel just go that little bit further. And it means the world to myself and Jazz. We will talk to you guys later on in the video. <laughs> Slower than the Titanic. Oh, for you, good. One more. Let's go. That's better. Tired, hungry, and it's Monday. <laughs> <laughs> that about sums up my training tonight. <laughs> That's good thing, my snatches felt really good today. Happy with that. Let's get some food and some sleep. <laughs> It feels like I haven't taken a shot from the top of the fridge in quite a while. It's weird that you've done this because I was thinking on the way home, we've not done that for ages. I wonder if we should um, end a video like that tonight. I didn't do all the snatch pulls tonight just because my trap was playing up a little bit and it's kind of on the verge of being injured but not being injured but then being injured but not being like, it's like, it's right in the middle and uh, I don't want to push it so the snatches I can kind of feel it but then the snatch pulls because they're heavy wasn't the wise move so I kind of I kind of 
stop my workout there. But today was good, and I'm gonna finish off this video by sharing two things that maybe you wanna watch after this video, because you know when you go onto YouTube usually, and then you start watching something, and then six hours later you're watching cat videos? Jasmine wanted to start a cat channel. There's a fact. <laughs> Didn't you? It was my first, me and my best friend Katie were gonna start a YouTube channel called Crazy Cats, Jasmine and Katie. <laughs> So my two links of today will be down below and the first one is bad lip reading They've just released a new video and it's over Rogue One. I think it's over Rogue One. It's over Star Wars Pretty funny and the second link. I'm not much of a movie person, but recently we watched Marvel I don't know which, I don't know which one it was and they just today released the trailer of Thor Let me, What's the name? Thor Memorock Thor Ragnarok where he gets captured and whatever and then he has to fight the Hulk. I can't wait for that movie to come out. That looks it does look epic. <laughs> yes! We know each other. He's a friend from work. Oh come on. Okay, links down below. If you did enjoy the video, hit the like button. Sunny Webster training session one. Week one, get Done. strong. Done. <laughs> you having the chocolate food? Yes. Oh, oh, oh. yes. <laughs> oh, that was steaming hot. You have to be. Okay, see you later, guys. Oh, yeah. That hurts so much. Okay, catch you guys in the next. I, I give up. One. If he survives, if he survives the steam, bloody idiot. <laughs> Just owning, he's just owning the drive. Garage. Sparky. Come on, bro. Back over here. No, don't go running away from me either. Come on. You get me in trouble. Don't pull the sad face. Don't pull the sad face just because you know you've been caught. Step and at the edge of the water, long as I can remember. You are happy. <laughs>